Hey guys, happy Friday. Just wanted to follow up on a post that I did this morning on the fabulous and beautiful chimes. And so I have a couple that I mentioned in my post here on display. We also have this bar chime here. Um, but as you can see, we have the Koshi chimes. This is an energy bar chime. And then behind me is this tabletop chime. So what I'd like to do is just play a few notes for you from each of these so you can get a feel on how the chimes sound. And they all produce very different sounds. Some of them are more high-pitched dissonant sounds, um, whereas some of them are a little more soothing and, and relaxing. But um, they each have their own purpose. And I'm going to do a couple videos, probably a, a one specifically on these beautiful bad boys here. <laughs> um, the Koji Chimes, these are one of my favorites, so I'll go a little bit more in depth in those. Um, but, you know, chimes are just really great for relaxing, calming, and really grounding yourself. Um, so let's go ahead and start with the Koji Chimes. So as you can see, there's four of them, and they each represent the different elements. So earth, water, air, and fire. So I'm going to play one of them just so you can get a feel for how it sounds. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. Koshi chimes are amazing. So I play sometimes one at a time, maybe two at a time, or I can even just push all four. Gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I love using these in sound healings. They're just, they're so healing. Um, the next one, this is called an energy bar chime. And this is really great for balancing chakras. And I use these a lot in my healings. And I'll go ahead and play a sound. So as you can hear, it's like kind of that high-pitched chime ring. But it's really great because it lasts a long time. And I can use it to smooth over the chakras, the energy system, the aura of my client, and really just smooth that out with this chime. It's fabulous for that. And then we have this tabletop chime back here. And this one, these, this is a really pretty sound. You can play like that or just a little bit here and there, just a couple. So that's a really pretty sound. It's great, you know, between instruments um, or even at the end or a beginning, the beginning of a session. Um, so as you can hear, they're really different. Each chime has a completely different sound and produces different results. Um, so it's really, when I'm in a sound healing session, I really just intuit what the client needs and I feel the energy and maybe they need a little bit more you know dissonant sound like this or maybe these chimes but maybe at the end of the session to do some nice grounding and to really get centered I might play the Koshi chimes so thanks again for watching I hope you enjoyed listening to these beautiful chimes of course if you have any questions do not hesitate to reach out to me thanks so much have a great weekend